So the Louis Gustavo objective is out. And before you go out, his car doesn't look great. Remember, he does link to Ronaldo if you manage to get him. Obviously, of course, it depends on that. The four-star weak foot, three-star skill moves, play CDM or center mid. Looks like a pretty good card overall. In terms of traits, nothing too crazy. And then what we have to do to complete him is in goal hunter, score six goals using players from Brazil in squad battles or rivals or foot champs. Easy, you can do that in one game. Then we have assist three goals with through balls, which is going to be Y or triangle on your controller. And you need to do that, again, you can do that in one game on squad battles, rivals or foot champs. Then we have score assists using midfielders in three separate matches. Again, semi-pro, rivals or, again, in foot champs. And if you know what that is, it basically means you need to get a goal with a midfielder, preferably a center mid, a cam or a CDM. I don't have left mid or right mid count. Once you've got the goal, you just need to pass with them and score with somebody else straight afterwards in three separate games, and you've got that one done. Then we have got ourselves a win, six squad battle matches with the Saudi League players in your 11. So again, you can only use one player, not too bad. If you don't have any in your team, there is a player you can use in an SBC, and I'm going to show you some tactics in that as well, as well as how to find it in the league. So first of all, we're going to go to... This player here, he is the one that... Are you tired of playing sweat teams like this? Make sure you go to Alt9, select foot, select foot 23 coins, choose which console and how many coins you'd like to buy, select your payment method, and don't forget to add code NANIC for 6% off on all orders. It's actually, you can use as you want to, how much is it gonna cost you? An 84 rate squad, so it's not too bad. And then if you were to add, it to, add them to your team, as it were, if you don't have an El Waran, or if you don't have an El Jabba, for example, we can go down to here, press X or square, press Y or triangle. When you go to leagues, if you scroll down, you shall see it's here. So it's called the R-O-S-H-N Saudi League. And at any player you've got in here, whether it's a loan or whatever, you can use a silver. Just stick them in and you'll be able to get that done. So it's not too bad to do. In terms of custom tactics and strategies, if you want to do this in rivals, go to 4 triple two, set balanced defensive style, 45 whip, 70 depth. Balance, direct passing, 50, uh, 5 in the box. And then we have 2 on corners, 2 on free kicks. Like I said, the 4 triple 2. In terms of instruction, you want to have balance, get in behind, balance, balance. Balance, get in behind, balance, balance. Then we have come back on defence, get into the box for a cross. And then balance, balance. Come back in defence, get into the box for a cross, balance, balance. Two CDMs are going to be cut passing lane, stay back while attacking. Balance, cover centre and balance. And the exact same for the other one. Cut passing lane, stay back while attacking. Balance, cover center, and we have balance on that one. Then our left back and right back are going to be stay back while attacking, balance, overlap, and balance. And your right back is going to be the same. Stay back while attacking, balance, overlap, and balance. Reason being is when you don't have the ball, your two strikers are going to stay on the halfway line. Your right cam and left cam are going to drop back into a 4-4-2, making you really, really compact and really, really difficult to deal with. I highly recommend putting your Saudi player up front. If you don't want to do anything else, if you have to do any objectives with that, or a Brazilian player, should I say, up front. Because once you've got the goals, you don't have to worry about it anymore. When you do have the ball, of course, your two strikers will be ready to go. Your left cam and right cam are going to immediately switch and try and get into the box for a cross. You don't have to cross it. It's just a stat or a... Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? An instruction to basically drive them into that location so you can play the ball in. Then what I like to do with my most attacking CDM out of the two, I move them manually with the ball forward. So we have five in attack like that with Goretzka. Or you can go into defense with Kimmich and then the four at the back. The reason why your left back and right back are going to be overlap and stay back is because when the AI notices, let's say Reese James, for example, his left back in front of him, your opponents move them out of position. The AI will actually move them up into the space looking for the run. And if the AI then notices that and your opponent moves his left back back, your right back will just turn around and walk back into position. So you're never caught out on a counter attack. You've always got the space to attack. Another thing that's good about this formation in terms of tactics as well is you play in little triangles. We have a right back to the right cam to the CDM. That is one triangle there with these three players. Then you can use that into another triangle with Haaland, Granabri, and Goretzka as one triangle. And you can do the exact same on the other side with Kimmich, Cruyff, and Son, and Ashley Cole, Son, and Kimmich. And once you start to learn to mix the triangles up, you can switch it from Son to Haaland, back to Gnabry, back over to Cruyff. You're going to have so many opportunities to score, so many uh, possibilities in creating space, and much more. So just to recap, we need to score three or six goals with Brazilian players. We need to score and assist in three separate matches with midfielders. And on top of that, we need to basically get three through balls and then six wins with one Saudi League player in your team. As always, if you have any questions, comment down below. If you're new to the channel, hit that like button and subscribe. And I'll catch you in the next one. See ya.